Ooh, it's a sunny one down in Miami. Battle of um, uh, Florida. Yes, sir. I think that's going to be the name of this episode. Battle battle for Florida because ain't nobody care about Tampa Bay. Ain't nobody worried about no Tampa Bay. And this will not be returnable. It's out of the back of the end zone for a touchback. So here come the Dolphins now as they get but set to take over. Who's number eight? And they will be led out by a guy certainly still trying to prove himself Who? here in the league, the young rookie quarterback. Oh, my goodness. I don't know why I thought I was Miami for a second. I'm like, where is Trevor Lawrence? Throwing on first down. Herring. And a screen unsuccessful. Yep, no screenplay for you, buddy. But welcome back, y'all, to another Madden Rebuild video. How y'all doing today? How y'all doing today? I don't even know who reverse Miami today, obviously, as you can see. Reverse, I don't know, a, maybe a rookie QB Herring? Like a, I think. Not sure, though. Cam, 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 Cam. I need, I need my guy Cameron Crow to, to intercept that, bro. That was easy money. Oh my goodness, Jalen Waddle and Tyreek Hill are gonna be lethal today. Oh, I think they're finally running the ball. Let me, let me bring a blitz. Let me bring a blitz. All right, well, they haven't. This has got to be a run. I'm blitzing. This has got to be a run. It is. Kareem Hunt. I didn't know. That's the running back. Okay. All right, let's see what we do. All right, they're kind of rolling on us. I'm not gonna lie. I haven't played Madden in a little bit. From the red zone now, they'll look to throw. To the end zone. I need Malcolm Wall to get up there and intercept that man. From a defensive perspective, when you break the huddle in the red zone, tight end is one of the guys you got to key on because quarterbacks want the ball in their hands fast in this position, and they want to get it to someone. Yep. 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 No sir, no sir. Yard there, but only a yard leaves him with third and nine looming. They'll come to the line here, needing nine yards to pick up the first. Expect a pass. To throw on third down, Herring. That's why he stepped out fourth and inches. Woo! You know what I would do here in, in this situation, y'all. I'm going for it every day of the week, and then some. They're going to take the field goal, and it is going to be good, though. We, we have to see what they're bringing. They're not, they're not running the football a lot. We have to see what they're bringing. And we got a little bit extra yards on the return there. Out to the 29, almost the 30. Ooh, hold up. They're led by the number one overall pick in the 2021 draft, Trevor Lawrence. Now Lawrence on first down. Oh, my goodness. Who was, who was guarding him out there? Who was keeping in stride with him? Is that, is that Baker? I do I do enjoy Baker as a, as a football player. I do like Baker's play. He's very good. And I also like how open this first down is going to be. As y'all know, we're still missing Christian Kirk. So, need Zay Jones, the Webster, and Pryor to come out big here. They sent a blitz there. We weren't ready to pick it up. And we need uh, 
obviously Etienne to you know keep doing what he's doing and keep making big plays for us. Well, no, e we know Etienne will get his if it comes down to it. That's that's what we know for sure. I could have waited for Engram, but I don't think I had a, a lot of time in the pocket there. We do have the first seed in the AFC. Oh, I thought I could break it out. We do have the first seed in the AFC, so we need to keep trying to. We need to keep winning games so we can hold that, because that will be huge. Why he could have just threw it to the right, but there was nothing open there. Fight for the first down prior. That's what I'm talking about. Good play. All right, let me look at their their defense. So they got Xavier Howard, unfakeable strip specialist, and DeAndre Langford, X Factor with bench press. Okay. I did not know they had an X Factor on this defense. Is that's going to be the last play of the first quarter? down three but we're, we're we're going on a little drive of our own got a bunch of superstars on the line for us etn gonna get another big gain Ah. They're going to give me grounding. to throw that football away and that draws the I accidentally picked this play box, right? get outside of each tackle and then you can go ahead and throw it away and you're in good shape but if you're back there in the pocket you got to make sure of what you're doing say Jones hold on to the football Patterson is money. We, we should have scored a touchdown, but I got a ground and call instead of taking a sack. So. Not ideal for us, but we matched their points, which is just good enough for now. We'll have to, have to get the pass game going because the run game's going good. But we need the pass game going also if we want to get this going. Let's send a blitz. This could be risky because they're, they're loading up. On, uh, yeah, I don't like that. They're loading up on the left side. You can throw the check down to the running back. Gain of seven. Now we're going to send a blitz. This looks like it could be something good. Cisco's got... Flat zone KO. As soon as I left him, man, as soon as I left him, he threw it. And I got a lineman who's down. Throw again. 
That's like, oh my goodness, bro. Like, that happens to me so damn much. It's it's unbelievable how much that happens to me, man. Come on, dude. What, what can I do about that? Big hit. Big hit. Oh, Campbell kid intercepted that. I'm actually going to send a blitz. Oh, and we stop him. What defense. What great defense. That's what we love to see, man. That's what we love to see. And he got lucky. That kick started on the outside of the post. All right, we got to try to cash in. Got to try to cash in. Defense comes up big again and gets us a field goal. That was such poor run blocking. Two minute warning. We get ball at half, so. We're, we're, we're playing like we're getting ball at half. Third and 26, man. Oh my goodness. They sent the mid blitz. I should have known. I should have known it was mid blitz. I should have known it was mid blitz. So now after the sack of Lawrence, the Jags looking at a third and long. And we have to run this, man. On third down, here's ETN. And some space here. And past the 40 before he's out of bounds. Now fourth and four. And that's why we went for it. That run, that 20 yard run was like, yep, no, that we're going for it. It was it, it was settled already. It was settled already. Give them credit. They knew what they wanted to dial up on fourth. They executed it for nine yards, and the offense stays out there. On first and ten, it's ETN. Jukebox is gonna be clutch right now. Call our first time out right there. The Jaguars gonna go ahead and use their first time out. It's just I just I felt it in the veins that we needed to go for it. Then throw the check down here. Did I get out? Paul Agnew goes down. We that's not what we want to see. Yeah, I felt bad. That might give me a holding call. Roughing the passer. Yes, sir. Yes, sir. Yes, sir. Accept yes, that. Abdominal strain. You can. You can. He. He can go back to the locker room for now. He can go back. He can go back to the locker room for now. One more. 
first and goal and a great opportunity. And he'll take this. Let's go, ETN, the workhorse. Travis ETN. As the first half is winding down. And the Jaguars have taken the lead here. The workhorse. The Trojan horse. Mr. Reliable, all the names I can give him in the world. Extra point by Patterson. Touchdown right there at the end of the half, which is great because, you, as I said, we get ball at half. We're putting the pressure on the Dolphins' defense instantly, and hopefully Paul Agnew is back out there ready to go. Eight seconds. They're just going to run the football. Seconds on the clock, really not a lot of time to try to put anything together. And an anxious moment or two and there, but they do get him down. Now, now they're going Hail Mary, okay. Three seconds left in the first half, and you see the clock almost empty, so this is likely the last play in the second quarter. The final shot before break, Herring. And that is intercepted, or was it? When they're lucky. It they're lucky. You don't want you don't want to start Malcolm Wall off in the second half with an X factor. I want to keep running the football. It's been good. They haven't run the ball much. A lot of short passes. A lot of short passes. Welcome back. Halftime over. We are ready for quarter number three alongside Charles Davis. A lot of short passes for them in that first half. ETN has been work forcing today, man. We gained a yard, thankful, thankfully to that guy who hit us forward. We broke the century mark on our yards. Let's see what we can do here, though. One of our favorite plays to run. One of the most reliable plays to get us a couple yards. Ooh, I like how this sets up on for the run on the right side. Bringing their safeties down. Deep shot for Webster. Oh my goodness. What was that? Why did the I think we can get seven yards on a run here. We crossed. Let's go. When you have a when you have a running back who can get you third and longs, you're in a good position. Oh my goodness. This would be an absolute monster out from Christian Kirk if he was out there. Thankfully, he didn't intercept it because I don't know what happened to Zay Jones right there. He kind of just stopped running on the route. Why am I getting poor accuracy? Zay Jones! My guy! How am I getting poor accuracy there? Look at, how, look at how much they're stacking the box trying to stop our run. Don't get me started on the players yelling, Woo! Whenever, whenever they get a juke move that works. Like this, this. This, this defense is set up to stop the pass. 
So it's it's hard to uh, try to get something going here. Evan Ingram, stiff arm him. First down and some. Yeah, it's 53 passing yards proves to you that this has not been a passing game. Not at all. This is an ETN masterclass game, and that's what we needed. Let's see. Oh, he, bro, he cuts in and gets all the way back on the outside, bro. I'm going for it. Stick. Why stick? <coughs> it's the go-to play. Zay Jones. End zone. <coughs> Zay Jones, his fourth touchdown on the year. And the Jaguars will add on to their lead here in the final minute of the third. <coughs> Extra point by Patterson up and good. And that pushes the lead up to 11. Yes, sir. Yes, sir. To kick this one away. zone for a touchback so here are the Dolphins now they get ready for their first possession of all right the half. here we go well their their first possession of the second half is coming with 42 seconds in the third quarter we took up a lot of time They'll start with and we're gonna now. stuff them stuff them like a nose let's go Shout out to anybody who has allergies. I'm I'm trying. I'm trying my best out here. It's tough. It's tough with allergies. But you know we gotta maintain. And that's gonna be the end of the third quarter. And they ran two plays in the third quarter. How about that? Yeah, look at our pass yards and look at our rush yards this compared to theirs, sir. And it's on EA Sports. I can ex yeah, the five wide. No, they're coming pass heavy here. I'm gonna try some though. On first and ten. I don't know why I tried that. That was a horrible idea. The big tight end. See what we got. Operating from the gun. Herring. Got a man and he hits him in stride. And he'll be marked down at about the 26 yard line. I need my pass rushers to get there a little bit sooner, man. Definitely crucial and critical. They know that they need to get at least three here to get it back to one score game. But I can't imagine that in their huddle that they're thinking at all about getting a field goal. They want to get into the end zone and then try and get the ball back again. It's a short one here, complete to the tight end. And he's brought down inside the 20 at the 18 yard line. They're rolling on us. Looking to throw on second down. Herring. He's going to throw it out the back of the end zone. Third and three. Complete. What a job by this defense all game long. They've come together and really said, no one's crossing our goal line. And they're definitely not going to start right now. You can just see the dejection. Feel like nothing is working out. He took a horrible path there. He could have ran straight for a one-on-one. I like running zone in the red zone, but I don't like rushing three ever. Second and one from the two. Huddle 
What a path from Devin Lloyd. He tried to cut back inside. Devin Lloyd said, no, sir. Two running backs, one tight end. And we get a sack. <sighs> Let's go, man. And they're kicking the field goal. Kick is up and good. All right. Eight point game. Field goal. Uh, makes it a two-score game. A touchdown essentially ends the game. So we're not going to be playing super conservative. But I'm also not going to be playing not conservative. Well, how did I lose my X Factor? <clears throat> can't stop him. Literally can't stop him. He's the best running back in the league. Derrick Henry who? CMC who? Jonathan Taylor who? Come on, man. This is too easy. Fourth quarter. Down to the final two minutes. And we've got a one-score game. All right. So it's Jaguar football here as we welcome you back. Have to imagine this will be on the ground as well as they come up second and seven. And they'll go again with ETN. And a good 20, who is that? Was that 29 or 23? Whoever that was just saved the game for them because the, how fast he sprinted across the, the line to get over there was crazy. Fourth and eight, though. <clears throat> Gonna punt. Eighteen yards. They gotta go about eighty. Gotta go about eighty yards. Let's see if I can force a one-on-one -on, -one on the outside. Yep, we can. You know they're gonna. You know they're gonna be coming out swinging. They'll look to throw. Doing the check down. They're gonna. They're gonna run it. They're gonna run this again. No huddle. He'll look to throw. Over the middle into traffic, and that's complete. The players literally have to be getting tired. He didn't even try to make a play on the ball, man. No, sir. <coughs> Trayvon Walker. He hasn't got to the QB all day, but today he's getting there. Yes, sir. We got to run the ball once, and then we can take the victory lap knee. Well, Jacksonville won the battle of Florida today, not Miami. And we're taking this win, and we're running to the bank. We're trying to cash out the first seed in the playoffs. The playoffs will go through Jacksonville, Florida. Sunny days in a cold month. But hope you all enjoyed nonetheless. I'll catch you all in the next video. See ya.